guys, it's Vixen and welcome back or if you're new here my name is Vixen and I am a college student that likes to read. Um, but yeah, this video is going to be just basically a vlog. It's also midterm week so it's kind of a mixture of a study vlog and just... show you guys a book I just got. Uh, I just got this book. The Boy Who Was Raised as a Dog. This is, um, it's a, but a few, like, stories from a child psychiatrist's notebook. The, and it's like anonymous, anonymous size? Everyone's anonymous in here, so you don't actually know who people are. But it's by Bruce D. Perry who has a PhD and a master's degree in uh, psychiatry and all that. Oh well, yeah. So that is a non-fiction read. I tend to, and I'm also reading an arc right now. But, but I haven't been reading too much since this term has been crazy. It's actually one of my more laid back weeks homework wise, but homework, work, which is actually, this is usually a lot more, it's just I have, we don't have a meeting this week because I am working today, and then, uh, I'm currently, I finished most of these yesterday, and then I'm filming right now, so, but on Thursday, I have my midterm, so that's gonna be fun, and, yeah, but today, is just health class, work right afterwards, hang out with a friend, chemistry class, and then I'm off for the rest of the day because I am not not going to the optional work meeting. I mean, I would, but like, me and my friend are going to be working on homework at that time because we're going to finish our weeks for chemistry homework to get it done with since it is due tomorrow and I have uh, I'm working tomorrow from about 7 o'clock till 10 o'clock almost because it's a event clean tear down and clean up but yeah it has been crazy and but um I still have a little bit before I have to go to my health class, so I'm just going to watch YouTube, relax for a little bit, just enjoy the little things, <laughs> so yeah, see you guys later. guys I'm back sorry I'm like really tired but I totally forgot to film all the day I think I filmed parts of it and I'm going to put in the small little things that I did but um I forgot to like vlog kind of but I'll show you guys I'm currently waiting on a friend to get here and some food and I'll show you guys what I would working on. Uh, I was working on, I finished my project to outline, which is writing an instruction manual, which I can, it's just an outline of what I want to write about. I picked uh, planting a garden, and then I also finished my writing classes notes and my writing activities for that. Oh. And my friends here, I'm gonna go let them in real quick.
the robot. That's a king. That's not a king size. What the heck? That's my smoothie. Let's go. Hey guys, it is the next day. I just finished up with a therapy session and went to the bathroom. I need to eat breakfast still, but I didn't actually get a lot of filming done yesterday, I realized. But yeah, I'm gonna, see, I'm gonna show you guys my strawberry plant. Oh, look at me. It's so cute. See that side? Oh, look at that building. It's so pretty. Is that that? So I wrote my to do list, uh, film. <laughs> edit my final draft of project one for writing class. Uh, I have a lab today at noon, so I'm going to be working on two notebook assignments. I want to work on two summary assignments, do a quiz, and then I have an event I have to be at at 7 o'clock to help set up. But yeah, that is the to-do list for the day. But I am going to eat breakfast and watch YouTube. Oh. just finished my lab for the day so yeah I'll probably insert a photo of one of the things we did oh yeah mm -hmm. I'm gonna get a pretty scar on hey guys I'm back I'm sorry I'm not in the best mood I am currently doing laundry and there's some family problems happening, but I have finished almost everything on my to-do list. The first thing was film, so the last thing is an event that's later tonight, but I finished the two summaries, or at least my part, and I finished editing a final project, and now I'm just kind of looking over one of my papers that I had to write that determines a lot of my grade, but yeah, I figured I should probably update you guys. I am waiting to get close to my laundry being done so I can go pick up my package, because it's only like a five minute walk, like two minutes for them to give it to me, so uh, I can show you guys what all I've knocked off that to-do list. I can uh, probably do some more. I could probably like work on my reading. That's tomorrow. Maybe do this. I don't know. But yeah. Just got all that stuff to do. So um I'll probably go pick up my package real quick and get my laundry and then I'm probably gonna work on my nutrition reading or just reading a book to relax. So yeah. See you guys later. I wonder if you guys will see me. <laughs> We're hosting an event for my job, and it's going pretty well. But yeah, there's a lot of people. It's Thursday. You might have saw my clip a few seconds ago, but it is midterm day. I'm gonna die. I'm trying to figure out how I'm supposed to get all the way over here and all the way to where my thing is because I also have to shower and eat. But yeah, I'm going to be meeting up with a friend in a little bit just to like hang out. This is my chemistry friend. You guys want a strawberry update? 
She's still alive. So, yeah. Um, I have roller derby today. It's just going to be fun. And then I have the chemistry winter afterwards, which is going to be horrible. And then, yeah. But, a uh, little reading update. I forget that when it's midterm week or any type of big test week, I tend to speed read because I get stressed out and reading kind of helps me calm down a little bit. I started reading Shadow and Bone two days ago and now I am this far in. I ordered on Pango Books uh, Siege and Storm and R Ruin and Rising because I, I am invested. It's like one turn after another. I was like, oh, she should totally get with that person. And I'm like, and then it's a whole turn around. I'm like, what? Like, I actually did not see that coming at all. And I was like, holy shit. That came out of nowhere. So, that was a surprise. I do actually really like the way Leah Bardugo writes. It's a good mixture between the two of like too fast, but also too slow at the same time. So it's right in the middle for me, where she speeds up when she needs to and slows down when she needs to. And I'm like, how, like, I don't know if I really like Mal as a person. He is an interesting character. He seems kind of oblivious, but he also seems like he's really emotional in certain ways. And I just kind of wish we would get to see from his point of view a little bit. I did hear that the second book in this story, series is kind of slow. It is Friday. I took my midterm yesterday. It was horrible. <laughs> For sure. Um, I have a one class today and then I'm going to probably do homework and a little bit of work and go home. But yeah. So I'm probably going to make this the end of the video. Uh, there's a little update of where I am in my book. Uh, I'm not doing a March wrap up. April map wrap up. No. I didn't finish much, but this is what I'm at. I have the next two books coming. I'm just. This is where I'm at. End up. So, thank you guys for watching. Please leave a like, subscribe if you like videos like this and want to see more.